I'm Christy Hughes back for another daily intention. I'm kind of laughing because we're over 100 days into a 200 day series I did on Instagram back in early sobriety. Now I'm reading those aloud and working my way through them here on YouTube. And being a little over three months, almost four months into the process, I'm thinking about how many times my hair changed over those four months. So definitely using a little self-expression here with my dark hair for winter, my cherry color that almost matched the color of the shirt I have on today. Now I'm back to blonde, maybe a little blonder than I would have liked, but uh, I needed a change and, and so here we are, ready for summer. But I just love the idea of self-expression, no matter what that looks like for you, whether it's tattoos, whether it's home decor, just find your freedom when it comes to that type of self-expression. I don't know if that relates at all to today's word, but today's focus and intention for the day is to fill the day with desire. And what I wrote about desire is... I am not talking about physical or material desire. Although if you need more passion in your relationship, by all means, create it. In recovery, we begin with a desire to stop drinking. And we foster that desire above all unhealthy cravings. It is good to desire healthier habits for ourselves. It is when we desire it bad enough that we are willing to cease a previous way of living and create a new norm. We learn to prioritize actions which support our desires. If you have the strong feeling of wanting something to happen, in quotes, because that's the definition, are you structuring your time and energy to fulfill it? Reflect on what you need for yourself and fill the day with desire. So if we revisit that definition again, a strong feeling of wanting something to happen. So again, doesn't have to relate to physical intimacy or sexual desire. It could be wanting something to happen very badly. And sometimes that is getting back on a healthier track, whether that be nutrition, movement. Um, my, shirt, my shirt today says chill on it, so maybe it's relaxation, stepping out of hustle culture for a little bit and finding some rest and renewal. If you desire that strong enough, you will be able to create the time, the space, the energy to commit to it. Start small. If you're desiring more calm in your life, can you set aside 10 minutes to go just sit outside and enjoy bird song and green, go to a park, whatever that might look like to find that calm? Just 10 minutes. Maybe it's breath work. Maybe it's on getting on the Peloton. Maybe for you, it's a desire for a healthy fit body and you can get on the Peloton for 10 minutes a day till you can work yourself up to 20 minutes, 30 minutes, whatever that might look like. Even if you never get past 10 minutes a day, that's okay too. If you desire it badly enough, you will find the time to carve it out. Just like I am committed and passionate about sharing these daily intentions, it's not always easy. I have a lot of noise in the background sometimes when my husband is around so I came over here I desire to spread this message and to help you find positive intentions in your personal growth journey and so I come over here sit over here and film the videos and that is um, my desire to help others so what does desire look like for you right now in your life? What healthy habits are you creating to pursue that desire? Tell me about it in the comments. Subscribe to the channel and I will see you again soon.